Good afternoon, y'all. I got some beautiful hickory floor that I installed a couple months ago. Homeowners moved in. I guess I had a little, the center uh, heartwood right here that's starting to check. That would not be a good day to run that in your foot. So uh, luckily it doesn't run under the range and we're going to replace it. It's not a big job. Uh, it's not not a scary job, I don't guess you could say. Just sometimes you gotta just got to do it. So we're going to do it. I use some blue painter's tape just to run down the middle. Um, I just used it because I could see that better than a pencil line. Uh, it really doesn't ne mean anything. I just, like I said, I just used it just to, just to cut by. Use my handy dandy shop vac. Keep the dust down a little bit. But yeah, like I said, we're just going to cut down the left side, cut down the right side. Grab the multi-tool. And we're just going to finish the cuts out. Be careful. Don't let it jump off and get into your other piece. Uh, then you might... I would cuss. <laughs> so, I don't know. Just just be careful. But we're going to peel the tape off and I'm going to make two perpendicular cuts close to the end with the circular saw. Then we're just going to grab the chisel and take this whole center section out. That's the only thing we're doing is taking this center out and be able to make it easy to get the groove side and the tongue side back off. So I just kind of beat it over just a little bit, use a multi-tool, finish the cut, and it comes out really easy. Then we'll just repeat on the on the tongue side. So it takes a little more uh, finessing over here just because it's been fastened down. Then you're going to cut your piece to length. Exactly. Make it precise. I'm going to take the table saw and cut the bottom side of the groove off. Leave the tongue side on there. And on your ends, cut the little tongue off of there and the bottom of the groove off on that as well. This has a little micro bevel, so I'm going to sand it with a sanding sponge. Just kind of replicate that. Make it look as factory as possible. Pre-drilling five holes. I have got a crawl space, so Brent is under there with some Craig screws. I'm going to stand on it, and he's going to fasten it from the bottom. That's right. Look at that. Nice and clean. 